Faye Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a thank you card for a teacher or somebody you have learned from. I'm going to take two fingers on the side and put a dot. And from that dot, I'm going to draw a curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line, keep going, keep going, curve line, connect. Now we're going to do an overlap, which just means that you start right here and draw a curve line, curve line, keep going, curve line, curve line, curve line, curve line. Connect. Now I come all the way over here on the right hand side. I'm just going to put a dot and I'm going to go curve line, 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 connect. I come back to my main section right here and starting over here on the left, I'm going to draw a big curve line up, over, connect. Inside, I draw another curve line, little curve line on the right, little curve line on the left, one dot, another dot. Okay? Starting over here on the left hand side, I'm just going to go curve line up, keep going, keep going, all the way around, keep going, connect. And now, every time I have an indentation, that means the part that's going in, I'm going to add a little straight line all the way across. Now, I come back inside this space, and I'm going to put little tiny dots on the inside of what I've drawn as a decorative detail for my drawing. I know it takes a while, but it looks really good. Keep going. You're going to do it on all three spaces that we have going on here. And one more down over here. Little teeny tiny dots. And really what you're doing is you're making a border print, only the border is on the inside of a space that you've already drawn. Okay. Now I come all the way down here to the bottom and we're going to write our little saying. And what we're going to write is thank you for teaching me how to shine. A nice sentiment if there ever was one. Exclamation point. Thank you for teaching me how to shine. Okay, let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, this is super easy. We're going to color the outside space in very nicely yellow. We're going to color the inside space very nicely yellow. We're going to take our yellow and in between the black lines, shine lines, we're going to put a little yellow straight shine line. Then, the only other thing we're going to do is we're going to add a dotted line border all the way around your sides. I'm going to leave my writing part alone. I'm going to come over here on the left and do it again. You can put a little one across the top. Now I have a border all the way around my actual picture. Okay? All right, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, this is my finished sample all colored in. Some people are still confused. 
When we get to this point of the videos, I have two drawings going on. The one that we drew together, and then this finished sample so you can see how it looks all colored in. Okay, bye-bye.